Hello and welcome to another quick tech tip with the Bearded Tech Guy. In this video, we will be going over how to update the firmware on the AA Wireless. To do the upgrade, you'll need a phone with at least 75% battery charge and the AA Wireless that will need to be plugged into power. I'll have a link in the description below for the latest firmware release notes so that you can decide if updating is right for you. To get started, power on the AA Wireless. While waiting for it to boot and for your phone to connect, verify that you're running the latest version of the AA Wireless companion app in the Google Play Store. After your AA Wireless is powered on and connected to your phone, which can be verified by the blue LED on the AA Wireless, open up the companion app. From here, click on OTA Update. The app will take a few moments to verify if your AA Wireless is running an older version or not. If it is, you'll be presented with this screen that shows the current version running and the latest version. If it doesn't need to be updated, then the app will let you know you are up to date. If you need to update, click on Start Download to begin downloading the new firmware to your phone. You should get a pop-up giving you the option to download now, download later, or cancel. You can click on download later if you'd like to download the update when connected to a Wi-Fi network instead of over your cellular network. But for this video, we will be clicking on download now. If you click on download later, you would just come back to the screen once you have the update downloaded and you are reconnected to the AA Wireless. All the steps are the same no matter when you download the update. The download will take a few moments and the length of time will depend on your connection to the internet as well as the size of the update. You'll have a nice little notification indicating how far along it is, as well as a fun little graphic while it downloads. Keep in mind that this is only downloading the update to your phone, and you can click on Cancel if needed. Once the download is complete, you can click on Start Update to actually update the AA Wireless. The first time I attempted to do the update, it did fail, but the app allows you to retry again by pressing the Retry button. While updating, you'll see a similar screen to when downloading the update, which will indicate how far along the update is. This will take a little bit of time. During this time, you need to make sure that the AA Wireless stays powered on and connected to your phone. I'd also personally recommend just leaving your phone alone during the update as well. Once the update is completed, the AA Wireless will go through a reboot. After the AA Wireless is finished updating and your phone reconnects to it, your phone screen will update indicating that there is no update available and that you're on the current latest release. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up as it lets YouTube know to show it to other people. And if you aren't already, consider subscribing to the channel and enabling notification to be one of the first to know when I release other tech and smart home related videos just like this one. Thank you for watching.